Behind the Lines is the fourth episode of the sixth season of Star Trek Deep Space Nine, 128th episode in the franchise. At this time, the USS Defiant is operating from Federation Starbase 375. Deep Space Nine station is under the auspices of the Dominion Cardassian Alliance under a non aggression pact with Baja. This had a Nielsen rating of 5.1 points, which was about 5 million viewers when it premiered. Plot Returning from another successful mission against the Dominion, Captain Sisko is informed that Starfleet Intelligence has discovered a massive Dominion sensor array. It is capable of tracking ship movements over five sectors and cloaked ships within two light years. Sisko determines that the only way to destroy the array is to approach it from through a star cluster. However, he will not be commanding the mission. Commander Dax leads the mission and is successful in destroying the array. Meanwhile, Major Kira and the others on Terek Nor are successful in spreading distrust between the Kardashians and Dominion by having the Gemahadar find Dammer's pad, in which he outlined a plan to poison the last batches of Ketracel White should they run out. Things nearly reach ahead between Wayan and Dukat who has still not been able to destroy the minefield until the female changeling arrives. She had become trapped in the Alpha Quadrant and wishes to link with Odo. He learns more about his people. Over a bottle of canna, Dammer tells Quark he has found a way to destroy the minefield. By using the station's deflector array, they can use an anti graviton beam to disable the mine's replicator units. Quark relays this information to Kira and Rom, who attempt to destroy the beam. However, the plan depends on Odo running a security diagnostic disabling the system's alarms and he is in the middle of linking with the changeling while Rom begins his work. Rom is captured by Dama. Kira confronts Odo, but he merely says that while linked nothing else matters. 